safely through in the FA Cup, that's all you can ask of them. Yeah, I thought first half we were good in patches. I thought, listen, you're playing, you were saying before, they're above us in the league. Mm. Um, they were, when we played their place, they, they looked they're a good team, they were some good players. Um, and Gary's gone in there, they, they've got better as well. So we knew it was a really difficult task, and I didn't expect to score four. I, I thought it would have been harder than that. But it, it was, we had to work harder today than what we had to work down at their place. And these are a good team. We played them again at their first game in the new year here. And I tell you, it'd be a game that'd be even harder again because they're improving, they're forever improving with the manager. So we, we've got to make sure that we keep doing the right things. Our unbeaten run continues over a period of time. Okay, yeah, the frustration the last week were, was sort of put to bed a little bit. To go and score four at home uh, is important. You know, I've scored four against Port Vale, four against these today, and then only up the one the other day, which is a bit unlike us in some ways. Not this year, in, in years gone by. To score, obviously, nine goals at home in that period of time is, is a tremendous. Uh, positive for me with the players, Billy getting another two goals coming back. Obviously, if there's a little injury they picked up against uh, Forest Green, the first half wasn't too bad. So, I'm really, really happy. And I thought what was big today um, three or four things. One, the big change of three of them, and then the fourth one coming very quickly. I mean, four changes, we're still 25 30 minutes to go. And a little switch, Leon said to me, get Brownie in that little 10 pocket, the gaps are starting to open up, and the staff behind me. Are working so hard to find answers by what we're trying to change in game without making subs, whether that be Moose, Leon, Shorty, and it, it just shows you that the strength and depth in the squad, but the strength and depth in the staff as well. And every single one of them are working so hard. And you know how I always the back list on the, on the on the outcome was a positive result. I, I can speak about everybody. It was a negative. We we take that on the chin and, and we move forward. But today to get round through to the third round, it's always an exciting time of the year. And for those people who have been here today and not watched Poland against Saudi Arabia or is it who was the other one? I don't, I don't know. Who the, it, yeah. There was another big game one yeah. at four o'clock, I think. So it's like the people, the Oxford fans being here supporting us and getting just short of near four thousand was tremendous again. It was a, it was a test of positivity from them as well. Mm. And, and that and that that's important that we we keep moving forward and I think from the poor start we seem to be sort of getting a little bit back on the front foot again. Not what we want, but a little bit. And I think that, to me, was not to show signs of us improving. That, that's not a coincidence. You're now getting players back. You've now got competition. Your bench is stronger. It's not a coincidence. I think we, we watched, watching the World Cup at the moment, people talk about having squads that would strengthen depth at the, at the top, top level. And, and from, you know, when you start coming down the, the pyramid of our game, it becomes even more prominent that you have to make sure your best players stay fit and the squad stays fit. And, and that to us, having Josh Murphy training yesterday and Yannick training yesterday, and then training around this morning, they both of them are training again. We're expecting hopefully one of them back in the squad for the weekend, there's one back in the squad the following week. So we, um, we, we yeah, that, that scene is a positive behind the scenes. Apart from England, it's been a very positive weekend. I, I thought the England result last night was <laughs> <laughs>